Hey guys, it's Saturday, May 27th. I'm starting this vlog on my phone today because I forgot my vlog camera inside and it's starting to rain, so I'm just not even gonna go in and mess with it. But I'm getting ready to run some errands. I need to run to Ulta and return something as well as pick up a facial sunscreen there unless I find one that I like at Marshall's because I'm gonna go to Marshall's too. And then I need to go to Nothing But Cakes and pick up my birthday bunt. So I'm just gonna get out and run some errands. Later I'm gonna do another lash lift, lash perm, and tent. I tinted them yesterday so I just need to do like the lift part today. So I am gonna film that for my channel. If you're interested in my lashes and how they've been like long and black, that's what it is. It's a lash lift and tint. So I'm gonna film how you can do that at home. I thought I would take you guys along. I'm gonna run some errands. I just got home. I didn't vlog very much while I was out running errands because I didn't bring my camera like I mentioned earlier, but Oh, my camera cap's not on. I didn't vlog because I didn't bring my vlog camera and my phone filled up and wouldn't let me take any videos or pictures. So I was like, okay. So that's why there's like nothing from while I was out. But I'll show you guys really fast what I got. I got a bunt cake from Nothing But Cakes, my birthday buntlet. This is my absolute favorite one that they have. It's the strawberries and cream, but they only are having it April and May this year, so it's about to be gone. So I picked that up for my birthday because a free buntlet, like who doesn't want that, honestly? I love, I don't know if anybody else is like this, I love to gather like all the free stuff you get from food places for your birthday and then go and get it on my birthday. And at Marshall's I got a curling wand and I wanted preferably like one and a half inch, but this one was one and a fourth inch and it was on clearance for $16, so I thought I would just try it. If I don't like it, I'll just take it back. And of course I got leggings because I love buying workout leggings at Marshalls. I've always really liked them. So I got these, what brand are these? RBX, I don't have anything by them, but they're just black, high-waisted. I love high-waisted workout leggings and then they're just capri length, so I don't have any, I don't think I have any right now that are high-waisted and nope, I do. I do have high-waisted capris, yep, and they're black. I just remembered that. But I love to wear black to the gym because it doesn't show sweat like colored leggings would. I think leggings are a good investment for me. I work out six days a week, so I don't feel bad about spending money on workout leggings, and Marshalls always has really good prices on them. Like, these were $15. And then I got another pair of navy. They're like dark navy. I don't know if you can even tell they're navy. But these are high-waisted as well. Well, are they high-waisted? These might not be technically high-waisted. They have a thicker band at the top, but they're probably like mid-rise, I would guess. They might not be high-waisted, but on me, they were high-waisted, like they went up high. And these were on clearance for $16, and I don't have any navy, like I said, I just usually do like black. But I really like these. They have the white detail at the bottom, and then they have this open cutout detail right here. And so I just thought those were super cute to wear to the gym, to wear like lounging around. I got this. It's a crystal stick deodorant. It says natural protection, no alumia, aluminum. So it's just, it's called crystal body deodorant and it's made of natural mineral, natural mineral salts which prevent body odor by creating an invisible protection barrier against odor causing bacteria. So if you've ever used anything like this or if anybody uses this, let me know what you think of it because I've never used it. It says all you do is moisten the stone and apply it to clean skin. I can't use antiperspirants anymore because they give me lumps in my armpits. So I've just been using a deodorant, but I thought that this might be a better solution. So it's literally just like a rock, like it's rock hard and then you just wet it and put it on, I guess? I don't know, so I'm interested to see how that works out. If you've used this, let me know, because I'm i interested in this, and I'm really hoping it works. I'm really hoping that it works. Also, I mentioned, minched. <laughs> also, I mentioned in the last vlog that Clay did a balayage on my hair. We did like an at-home balayage with the gift card that Sally Beauty sent me so that I can do a video for my channel. So that video is coming, I haven't filmed it yet, but this is the final outcome, and I'm literally obsessed with it. Like, I'm honestly shocked that it turned out this well. Like, I love it. Even my hairdresser friends are like, it looks really great. I'm like, 
Thank you. If you are into doing your hair at home, keep a lookout for that video because I'm really excited to do that. I feel like those videos get a lot of heat from professional hairdressers, which I understand. It's not for everybody, but you have to understand, one, not everybody can afford to get their hair done in a salon, and two, not everybody wants to. Like, I just didn't want to. I like this way more than when I've gotten it done. So I think it's just a personal preference thing. I don't think there needs to be like heated discussions about it. So if it's not for you, that's totally fine. But if it is, be looking out for that video because I'm really, really excited to show you guys what we did, what we used. And thanks again, Sally Beauty, for the gift card because now my hair was like $3, so. And once again, I know on the last vlog, that was like extremely close up, so sorry. <laughs> but on the last vlog, I know I was cleaning my desk but like look at it again you guys this is ridiculous i'm gonna eat some lunch and maybe my buntlet or maybe some of it and then i am going to do my lash lift so check back for the full video on that because i know a lot of people will really like this it's a great alternative to lash extensions and it's really not that hard to do if you go out and have a professional do it once again if you're just into having professionals do everything, you don't like to do everything yourself, like that's totally fine, but people are different. So if you like to attempt to do things yourself and you like to save money, I was really, really happy with how it turned out. They look really good, so I've really, really loved it. I've put mascara on one time in the past three weeks. I just finished my lash lift and tint video, finished filming the actual like application and how you do it process part. And then I'll film the rest of it, like my talking portions at another time. So I got this last night and I just used it in the shower for the first time and I'm super, super excited about it. I hope it works really well. It is a gradual self tanner moisturizer that you use while your skin's still wet in the shower. So I'm hoping that I like this because I always need to moisturize and never do. And I'm all about self tanners because I hate sun damage. that we made tonight has been our go-to recently. We have it literally almost every day for the past few weeks, but these tacos are so good and they incorporate everything that you need in a meal, so they're really, really awesome. This is what they look like when they're all done. They're so good. Corn tortillas, avocado, ground turkey. Sometimes we add these mixed peppers, which I love, and then salsa, and Clay puts cheese on his too. And sometimes we'll do like onions. We don't always do the peppers. Sometimes we'll just do shells, avocado, turkey, and salsa. But if you're looking for a healthy recipe, we absolutely love these. We eat them all the time. But we're gonna go ahead and eat dinner. I hope you guys had a good weekend and I'll see you next time. Bye. He is the jingle master. Where's my chips and pico? Where's my chips and pico?